What's up guys, it is Madison and this this intro has got to be a little sped up, but um, today is going to be my July favorites and I wasn't sure if I wanted to post this just because I only started um, uploading YouTube videos frequently in July, but I wanted to get this video up for you guys and yes, the TMI tag is coming. I promise you it is coming sometime. I'm going to go ahead and get into it because I mean, I don't have like too many things, but like I said in my last video, I can talk a lot, so let's go. So the first thing I'm going to talk about is uh, skincare, which this is not like base skincare, but it's still skincare. And it's just the Warm Vanilla Sugar Lotion from Bath & Body Works. Um, to be completely honest with you, I've had this for such a long time, but I use it more in the summer just because it's a very like warm scent and um, I don't know, I use like a lot more lotion in the summer for some reason. Okay, and the next thing is the CeraVe Moisturizing Lotion. And uh, Katie, which is Lustre Lux on YouTube, uh, suggested this just because, uh, actually it says for normal to dry skin, but I don't have normal or dry skin. I have very oily skin, but this moisturizes my face and it doesn't leave it greasy or anything. So I love it. Next thing is this Tarte Showstopper Clay Palette. It looks so dirty. I'm so sorry. But... Um, I got this in April. I got one for my sister as well. Casey, my sister. Um, but I really, really like it. I've really been using it a lot this summer. I'm wearing it today. But um, it's just it has really beautiful colors and it's very compact. So it's very easy to travel with if you're going to traveling or anything like that. So, I don't know. I really like the colors. I really like everything. I actually, not everything. I actually hate this blush for some reason. It's not my favorite, but for eyeshadows. And they are the NYX Prismatic Eyeshadows. Let me see if I can, oh, yeah, NYX. NYX Prismatic Eyeshadows. Um, I have almost all of them. I don't have all of them because I didn't like all the colors, you know. But I have some of my favorites. I have like a whole drawer full of them, but like I said, uh, they're all not as I would want them to be. These are my summer favorites. I've really been liking this, this these this summer. As I said, this one's called Liquid Gold, and um, me personally, I really like gold on blue eyes, which I have blue eyes if you didn't know. Um, I don't know where I'm going to swatch all these. But just like that. These um, prismatic eyeshadows were like, I don't know how much they were, but they were really good. Um, like, they're really good for NYX eyeshadows. No offense to NYX, I actually like your eyeshadows, but those are a lot better than like the regular eyeshadows, you know. I have a... I have matte eyeshadows. These are all my NYX eyeshadows. But I have this matte NYX shadow, and it is just not good. I mean, not not good, but it's not great, you know? See? That right there? I don't know. It's just not, not great. So, like I said, these are NYX Prismatic Eyeshadows in Liquid Gold, Mermaid, and Golden Peach. The other eyeshadow that I have, this is from the brand Bliss, I want to say. I don't want to. Okay. From the brand Bliss. And it looks like this. Bliss. It looks like this. It's just a very like. Champagne-y like. I don't know. It's very metallic. And just very beautiful for the lid. Um, I'm not going to lie. The, this formula is not the best. But. It is a very beautiful color. Like that. Like I said. It looks great on the lid. And I got this on, uh, from my Ipsy bag. So that's why it's still literally in this little plastic thing where it's home is queen did a collaboration with becca and this is the becca jacqueline hill champagne pop obviously I mean, there's a thumbtack in there because i was gonna hang this but i felt like that would be a little bit weird even though desi is right there and katie is above her because you know whatever uh, i have these little things there just so this does not break when i go to the beach but this is champagne pop from becca this does not even do it justice it is so beautiful. Can y'all see that? I'm shaking. It is so beautiful. It's very, very, very creamy. And I don't know. It just. Um, I'm not going to lie to you. It is definitely not a natural highlight at all. So if that's what you're looking for. This is not your girl. But like I said. It is a very, very beautiful highlight. And I really, really like it. thing I actually had in my haul that I did. And it's just this Rite Aid brush. Like I said in that video, I did not know Rite Aid had brushes, like cosmetic brushes, but they do. Go to your Rite Aid, pick this up. This is just the blending brush. It is, it is so good. It is so soft. It is, it blends like a dream. 
I love this so much. And I just got it. So go get it. Go to your Rite Aid. Get this blending brush. Um, I don't know how their other brushes do because, like I said, I didn't even know that they had any brushes. So I have not tried any other ones. But go get that one. I have is two primers. One is the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water. I've had this for like uh, two and a half months, I want to say. I've loved it every day, you know. So I just had to give a little shout out to this just because uh, not just this month, every single month I use this. I really, really like it. And the next primer is this Makeup Forever Step 1 Skin Equalizer. This one is in smoothing. And I, when I first got this, I was kind of iffy. I was like, I paid $32 for this. It better, it better work. It better be so good. <sighs> At first, I was very disappointed. But then, um, when the summer months came and I started, like, actually using it, you know, I really figured out that I really actually do like this and it really actually works. I don't know if it's worth them 32 bucks, but it's okay. The next thing is, um, it's a 10 Miracle Leave-In product. I don't say it. I just say it's a 10. But this is my second bottle. This one is full. It's my second one, like I said, and I just really love this. I put this on my hair every time I wash it. Every time I get out of the pool, if I'm not going to um, wash my hair like right after I get out of the pool. Because I'm that person, like after I get out of a pool, after I get out of the beach, after I get out of a river, a lake. I have to come and wash my hair because I, my hair is just... Does not need to be dirty. I'm not. I'm not that kind of girl. But um, yeah. So if I'm not washing my hair right after I get out of the pool, I just spray some of this in it to kind of diffuse some of the chlorine, you know, and help my hair a little bit. And then the last two products are actually lip products, and one of them is a NARS little uh, lip pencil. You know, this is like one of the birthday things. Y'all know that you get from Sephora, and it just looks like this. Uh, it doesn't have a name on it because it came in, you know, the little thing. Actually, I think it does, but I cannot say that. But I will link all this stuff below, as you guys know. Um, but this is one of their satin lip pencils, and it looks like this. That is like, the worst part I've ever did in my whole life. Then, um, the next product is a L'Oreal. Honestly, I don't know what these are called. I was just looking at them, and I've heard uh, really good things about them. They're kind of dupe for the YSL uh, moisture new things all right like I, said, I don't know what they're called but I like it this one they're pretty sheer you know they don't have a lot of color but I guess I was watching for you I tried to do a heart with this but that did not work they're pretty sheer on the lips though so whatever it just looks like this and this one is called rose melody that is all my favorites for this month and I hope you liked this video I hope it wasn't too too long um, I know this is going to be one of my longer videos on the channel, but yeah, I hope you guys really liked this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up. So make sure you subscribe, um, make sure you check the down bar as well because I'll have everything linked that I was talking about. And yeah, I'll see you soon.